to welcome AWS to Nairobi. We're grateful that you have decided to open this uh, center in our beautiful city, the heart of the Silicon Savannah. Amazon needs no introduction. It is not only the largest technology company in the world, but it's also a household name. I believe this new development center, which is the second in Africa, will play a major role in growing Kenya's digital sector and more so the city of Nairobi. During the last decade, you know, cloud computing was more about storage and hosted software as a service. Today, we're in the evolution of cloud computing. Our startups and businesses, just as Ambassador Meg has said, need flexible solutions, not just for data storage, but also for computing needs. Um, the AWS Compute uh, provides businesses the opportunity to pay only for the resources that they require, and that's a real big plus for us. The availability of on-demand services beyond storage means that businesses can scale the technology use without incurring unnecessary overheads. The provision of these capabilities is a democratization of cloud technology where this development center not only becomes relevant for big organizations, but also for small businesses for whom digitization is becoming critical for their operations. According to the World Economic Forum, Your Excellency, 97 million new jobs will be created by 2025 because of cloud computing and digitization. In Nairobi, our cash crop, you know, unlike uh, Nyandarwa, where the cash crop is Waru, <laughs> where my, my deputy comes from, in Nairobi, my DG is here, uh, Njoroge Mushiri, in Nairobi, our cash crop is our young people who are resilient, they're ready to learn new skills, they're amazing, and they have all that with them, you know, and, and, and any investment towards them, you know, for us is where our priority is. P.S. Tony will tell you, um, a few years ago, he invited uh, us to take young people to Konza. And I remember a young boy, um, six-year-old from Dandora, who had just interacted with the computer for the first time, defeated everybody in coding, just after three days of being taught. That talent is there. What lies under the ground, uh, in, 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 I mean, above the ground in Nairobi, really, is our talent. We don't have oil, we don't have gold, we don't have diamonds. Our greatest asset is not below the ground, it is above the ground, and it is our people. The fact... Thank you. So this development center, I, I pray, and I'm really happy. Your Excellency, I just walked across I have an office around here. This development center will be important in absorbing these highly skilled young people we have and bring part of these millions of jobs to our doorsteps. The fact that AWS will use this system to support major organizations such as Toyota, Netflix, Volkswagen, and the rest, um, together with handling some of its research and development for new products, cements Nairobi's place as Africa's silicon savannah. Your Excellency, you have, you have raised the brand of Kenya. You have raised you know, uh, the attention on Nairobi. I was with you in New York, and I saw the attention of the world. Thank you for being our chief marketing officer as Nairobi and as Kenya. And really, we must thank Ambassador Meg. I have never seen an envoy who believes in her station the way you do. You've gone out there, you've sold this place. We will do our part. Downstairs, I asked Amazon Web Services, what, what can I do as your governor to make Nairobi more comfortable for you? They said they're already comfortable. But I will, I will try, and do, I'll try and do a bit more. Um, AWS is not new to me, Your Excellency. In March this year, Nairobi City County signed a partnership with AWS. Um, my, my chief officer for Smart Nairobi is here, Tyrus, and he's been leading that together with, with, with AWS. It's a, it's a, Tyrus Njoroge, thank you. It's a beneficial partnership that we have seen, um, that's in the county receive six months worth of AWS cloud credits. Um, we have leveraged on this platform for various projects, including we host our liquor licensing um, uh, system on this, on this platform currently, and we intend to do much more. Through AWS, we've also co-created um, a citizen engagement and disaster reporting application, semana047.nairobi.go.ke, which we will, we will launch very soon this month because it is going to um, we leverage on this platform as part of our El Nino preparedness so people can report incidences and can get responses immediately from the county. Our efforts towards creating a city of order, dignity, hope and opportunity for all will be realized by large part, largely through exploiting data for decision making. As Nairobi City County moves towards reinventing its operations with data in the quest to create a comprehensive and inclusive smart city, we invite AWS to work with us to realize this. Your Excellency, I'm not wearing two watches because I'm uh, uh, flashy. I'm flashy, but not <laughs> because of wearing two watches. This watch here is our tap to it um, school feeding application. All our children in Nairobi are wearing this watch. We're using technology. Um, we know how many children are eating every day 
the quantity of food they're taking, the consent, and we can tell that they've paid through technology, you know, and, and we want to use more of this technology.